Hey everybody, it's Mama J, and I just got this box in the mail. I don't want to show you the addresses, but check out this sticker. That is a friggin' awesome sticker. Complimentary mystery, I'm trying to read it backwards. Complimentary mystery box from Collector's Conquest Amusement Archive. That's friggin' awesome, you know? I never even thought about that. Honestly, that's what I should do. I should make a sticker because I send out so many AOKs that I should make a sticker just like he did because that's a friggin' awesome idea. All right, so we're going to cut into this box. Um, he did mention that there was a box coming. Again, like I said, I'm not sure what's in the box. It is a mystery AOK -okay box. If you're not sub to Collector's Conquest or Amusement Archive, please go over and do so. I will link both of them down below. I believe when he reached out to me, he told me there was not a note in the box. Okay, well, this box is pretty full of stuff here, so where to start? First, we have Mystery Pets Adopt Me. And if you know, I love to open mystery items in blind boxes. Let's go ahead and we will pop this open and see what we got. All right, well, he is actually, that's, that's, you know what? Man, I'm going to show you this if I can get it off to show you guys. I think a lot of toys should do this. If you look, this egg is actually secured to the bottom so you can't pull it off, which is good because you and I both know that some kid whose mother isn't watching them will come along and yank that out and who knows where the hell it went, right? All right, so we took it off. It says exclusive virtual code, adopt me, 24 pets to collect. Ooh, mystery egg and pet inside. Find the golden dragon. Wouldn't that be something if I could pull that golden dragon? Most of you know I love, love opening the mystery stuff like this. I don't keep everything that I open when I buy it for series because, as most of you know, if I did, there would be nowhere for me to live because I enjoy opening it. I just don't have anywhere to put it all. And I don't want to dust it. All right, the struggle was real, because it's still happening. All right, finally. Woo-wee. All right, so we have the egg. Let's pop him open. Ooh, what did we get? What did we get? You guys can see. Oh, did we get a... What? We got a little tiny... Look at... It's a frog. I think frogs are really cute. Oh, yeah, there's a bull... Oh, he's a bullfrog. There's a chick, a ground sloth, a chicken, a pink cat, a black panther, a blue dog, a wild boar. Um, there's some different dogs. There's rats, bunnies, swans. Ooh, there's a fox. A hyena, ladybugs, pigs, chickens, roosters, the golden dragon, a winged horse for Caitlin. And then there's other stuff like if you were to buy multi-packs. But that's cute. So, and he does come with a little virtual card so you can go on and adopt him. But that's really cute. So we got the bullfrog. That's pretty awesome. That's really cute. And these are like heavy duty eggs. These aren't like the cheap um, Easter egg eggs, you know. All right, let's see what else is in here. All right, this is called Magic Wand Reveals Magic 8 to Collect. Okay, I'm not sure what this is, but we're going to open it up and see. I like that I'm getting minis that I don't normally open. Oh. And he's wrapped in tissue. Okay, so there are, there's Enchanters, Pixie, Griffin, and Jolly. Vanishers, which is Pyra. A Spellster, which is Ramizzi. Flyer, which is Gookie. <laughs> Morphlings, which is Toki and Lug. These are really cute. Oh my God. All right. So let's see which one we got. Okay, we got a little wand. I'm guessing they hold this maybe. Ready? Boom. Oh, we got the little cow. All right. I don't know if you guys can see that. See his eyes? I'm not hitting that. There we go. That is so freaking cool. <laughs> That's cool. Actually, we'll probably take this over and put it, because, like, I have a ton of stuff above my computer. I will probably take this over and put it above my mom's computer, because... She collects cows, so this will fit right in with everything she has because all she has is cows up there. And that's really cute with this. That is so freaking cute. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Put it back in the paper so I don't lose it. Because right, you know me, I'll be looking for that wand. All right. What else we got in here? Oh, look at 101 Dalmatians. 
It's a pin, so that's pretty cool. All right, what is, this is an Ushi. Oh, it's a Care Bear Ushi. Oh, I love the Care Bears. I've loved the Care Bears since I was a little kid, but I have a collection of custom Funko Pop Care Bears by different people throughout the community. All right, let's see which Care Bear we got. I was always partial to Tender Heart. Boom. Oh, this is Sunshine Bear, but look how cute he looks. He's almost like a translucent yellow because you can see like the stuff behind him. It's probably hard for you guys to see on the camera, but he's really cute. Oh my goodness. All right, next we have LL Dance Off Trading Cards. You know what? I'm going to give this, let my goddaughter open this, so I'm not going to open this on here. She is LOL obsessed, one of them. So I will save that for her because I am looking and I know there's more in here, so I know we got a lot of stuff to open. Okay, this is a Mellow Mellow Mini Collectible Plush. Okay. And these are the different ones you can get. See those? There we go. All right. If I'm going to pick one, I like Maggie the Koala. Blossom, which I believe is a panda. Steven is a cow. Wow. There's all kinds. I mean, there's a penguin, a, an elephant, a sloth. Wow. A unicorn. There's a rare. Ooh. Claire, the rare bunny is like tie dyed almost like with spots. That's pretty cool. All right. We're going to open this up. See what we got. I've never opened one of these before either. I'm trying to open it without looking. <laughs> All right, we got it. I am I think this is the face. Ready? Boom. Oh, it's upside down. That's why I was having issues. Oh, we got the penguin. Okay, the penguin is Darwin. <laughs> so that's Darwin the penguin. He's really cute. That's cute. That's cute. Darwin the penguin. All right, next thing I see here is a Stitch Collectible Mini Fig. Feed me Stitch, Stitch Down Mo A Manager, Stitch Dang, I don't know. Lots of words. <laughs> All right, so let's pop this open really quick. The plastic on it. Oh, I didn't even notice on the back. You can see all the ones that you can get. Get the plastic off. Might be able to see it better. All right, so these are the ones you can get right here. So I would say out of all of these, I would say the one right here where it looks like he has a sucker and he's kind of being goofy. I would take one of the pink ones too. I believe that's Angel or this one right here. I think that's a bat in his mouth. I'm not really sure, but they're very cute. Okay, so let's open up, see which one we got. Oh, even after I unwrapped it, it's still got a pull tab. I'm like, why doesn't it open? I like, you know, I know it's a little more difficult to get into these like this, but like this one, they even have it taped also. So it's like, okay, I know it makes it harder for, it's hard enough for us adults to get into it. I know it makes it harder for kids to get into it, but that's the point because otherwise, you know, what's going to happen. The whole toy department's going to be wide open. All right. He is in a bag. All right. This one ready. Boom. Oh, we got angel. I believe that's with the strawberry right there. That's really cute. That's really cute. I have a stitch up here, so I will probably add this angel to it because I do not have her. But that's really cute. So, oh, yeah, and see, it was a see-through bag. All right. And it's funny how it came in a burger box. All right, let's see. Anything else in here? Oh, there's some bigger items, but I'm trying to look at the other stuff. Okay. There is one of these wacky package minis. We've opened these before. They come with different mini blind stuff, so we'll open it up and see what we got in here. We got some Windex, Windex. All right, and the rest of these, I believe, are sealed. Yeah, they each come in their own little bag. That's cute, though, that the bag is like that. All right, we got some Creepgate toothpaste. That's funny. All right, next one. Oh, oh it's um like SOS pads. Brittle, brittle, brittle soap pads. I guess they're like SOS pads. I'm pretty sure that's exactly what they are. All right, next one. <laughs> It's Deco Cement. I will be keeping this. And if you know, you know my, my link with ducks. So I'll be keeping this. I do have a couple of duck legs floating around here somewhere. All right, last item is broken cookies. That's funny, broken cookies. So that's really cute. Again, I don't know how to keep all of these, but I will definitely be keeping the Deco 
because if you know, you know. And Angel and Sunshine Bear are going to go up there also with my collection that sits out here. All right, let me move some of this. All right, next thing is I can see the top, but I can't see the front, so we'll look at it together. Ready? Boom. What? Okay, I don't have this. It looks like the Lego. It's called Vino Mates. See, it's right there. It looks like the Lego. That is so freaking cool. I hate to open it. Yeah, I, I haven't. Some things I open and some things I don't. And I always say I open them because I don't get them to collect for other people. I get them to collect for myself. So she will probably come out of the box. So let me go ahead and take her out now to show you. Because I've always decided, I decided a while ago, not with Funkos, I usually leave them in the box. But with everything else, I decided a long time ago that I get them for myself to enjoy. So out of the box, they're usually going to come. And depending, like this is a nice box. It can go back in this box if that was ever needed. So like I have a place where I store all these inside each other. But this is friggin' cool. Look at that. And that'll go right up here with my Wonder Woman stuff. Wow. Wow. So, honestly, I, I mean, this has been a great box and there's still a few more things in here. So, you know, I mean, Collector's Conquest, Amusement Archive. Wow. All right, so let's see what else is in here. All right, let's go. I think this is, I'm going to assume it's a Funko. It's in a Funko box. The name says Four Cocos Jumbo Pop Vinyl. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but let's take a look together. Oh, okay. Should I pull this out? Toxic Glow Custom Conquest LED Black Light changes, Charges Best. That's what the note says on the inside. Ready? Boom. Oh, what? No way. Look at this. First of all, I just said earlier that I collect custom, what? I collect custom Care Bears. What the heck, dude? But check out the box. He's even made sure that he's kind of taking care of the box there. But either way, this is freaking sick. Look at that. Oh yeah, he made it because look, his sticker's on the top. Okay, hold up. Okay, hold up. I'm gonna pop the top, uh, bottom and take it out so you guys can see it. I know sometimes they're a little, iffy so i want to be careful here this is freaking sick oh no he's good he is good check this out that is freaking awesome so this is another awesome one to add to my care bear collection again like i said you know um i had extra care bears i mailed them out for people to work on if i can come across some more but yeah, these are what I really, I love the custom Care Bears from people in the community. And they're all different, all different. But this, this is freaking awesome. He will go right with all the other ones. I love these custom Care Bears. I love custom pops anyways from people in the community. But the Care Bears, yeah, I, I don't know what it is, but I really love the Care Bears. But I've always liked Care Bears, so that's freaking sick. That's friggin' sick. <laughs> wow. All right, there is, I think, one more thing in here, kind of a big thing. I'm not sure. Oh, what? Okay, this is friggin' cool. Look at that. I care. Love the earth. This is cool. Medium plush. <laughs> this is cool. I like this because it's the recycling one. This is really awesome. I will put a um, like a thing here so that he stays fresh and I can put him on display. If you put something, like when there are boxes like this because you can touch and feel him, if you can put something clear right here where you can still see him while he's on display, uh, if, you know, because I mean, obviously, I don't know, do they make top pop projectors this big? Um, but, you know, that way it protects him from getting too dirty while they're on display. I mean, unless you seal it to the box, which I usually don't, it slides right in there. Make sure to dust inside and stuff too so that they don't, you know, but yeah, the only other Care Bear I have in a box is the Tender Heart one. I still have one in a box. But this is freaking awesome. So, I, I yeah, I'm, wow, what a box. I don't want to knock over my custom Care Bear that's sitting right there. Wow, what a box. Cece, thank you so much. I mean, this box was amazing from beginning to end. There are so many things here. I, I mean, I know that, you know, it was a box built for me, like you said, 
But there's so many, I mean, I got lucky with things like, you know, this is going to go right there. You know, Wonder Woman, obviously, you know, and then getting the little Care Bear. He's cute, though. The duck cement, like, that's funny as hell. I mean, if you get it, you get it. If you don't, I, I, I think almost everybody gets it by now. But there, there was a funny video made a few years ago about it, too. Anyways, this is awesome. Thank you so much again. I was very mind blown, very touched. Great box. The custom was the best thing in the box, hands down. Dude, you could have just sent the custom and I would have been mind blown. But everything else is awesome too. Like I said, I appreciate it greatly. And make sure you guys go over and give them a sub on both channels. I will link them both down below. Stick around also. Check out my Patreons. If you're interested, there's a link down below. Otherwise, until next time, keep on rocking. And go check out Collector's Conquest.